Threads is an all-new app built by the team at Instagram. It launched to the public on July 5th, 2023, and officially reached 100 million signups within its first five days. According to Meta, the new Threads app is for sharing text updates and joining public conversations. So how do you use Threads? My name is Digital Girl, and in this tutorial, I'll show you how to do the following. How to access the Threads app, initial setup and creating your profile, how to follow and unfollow people, how to make a post, this will include text-only posts, images, videos, links, and you guessed it, how to make an actual thread on the Threads app, how to delete a post, liking, commenting, reposting, and quoting, and finally sharing a post to your Instagram account as a story and as a regular post. Before we get started, we invite you to share your Threads username in the comments to help find like-minded people and grow your audience on the Threads app. All right, so let's get started. How to access Threads. Currently, there is no web or desktop version of the app. So in order to use Threads, you will need to download the app onto your phone. You can do this by going straight to the App Store or Google Play. You can also go through your Instagram profile. From your profile, tap on the three lines in the top right-hand corner. You should see a Threads option. If you do, go ahead and tap on it. You'll see a cool looking invite with a button underneath it that says Get Threads. If you click on that button, it will take you to your App Store where you can download the Threads app. Initial setup and creating your profile. Once you install the Threads app, you can begin setting up your profile. You can either enter brand new information or import your profile details from Instagram. When you tap on the next button, you can decide whether you'd like to have a public profile or a private profile. Make your selection and then tap next. Threads will ask if you'd like to follow the same accounts you follow on Instagram. You can either select a few accounts manually or simply hit follow all. On the next screen, have a read through the info on how Threads works, and then tap on the Join Threads button. This will take you to the home screen. Follow or unfollow people. To make Threads more exciting to use, you're going to want to follow accounts that you find useful and entertaining. To follow more accounts, tap on the search icon at the bottom of your screen. Then type a specific person or brand in the top search bar. When you find the account you're looking for, simply tap on the follow button. To turn on notifications so that you're notified when this account creates a post or a thread, tap on the account, then tap on the bell in the top right hand corner. If you'd like to unfollow someone, tap on the search icon at the bottom of your screen, type in their name, and then simply hit the unfollow button. Now, of course, we would like to be following Shopify, so I'll hit that follow button again, but now you know how to unfollow someone. How to create a text only post on the Threads app. To create a text only post, tap on the post icon in the center of the menu at the bottom of the screen. Type your text, add emojis if you'd like, and then hit post. It's important to note that the limit is currently 500 characters. How to post an image on Threads. To create a post that includes an image, tap on the post icon. Type in your text and then tap on the paper clip or the attachment icon. Browse through the images on your phone, select an image and hit add in the top right hand corner. Then hit post. How to add multiple images to a post. You can add multiple images to a single post. Tap on the post icon followed by the attachment icon. Then select multiple images from your phone's media library and hit add. Type your text, add emojis if you'd like, and then hit post. You can select up to 10 items when adding to a single post. How to add a video to a post. Similar to images, you can add a video or multiple videos to your posts. Tap on the post icon and type in your text. Select the attachment icon. Browse through your media library and select a video or multiple videos if you'd like. Then hit post. How to share a link on Threads. To share a link on the Threads app, tap on the post icon. Type in your text followed by the URL that you'd like to share. Then Threads will automatically create a preview of the link you're sharing. Once you're ready, hit post. How to make an actual thread on the Threads app. 
A thread is a combination of posts that relate to one another and should be read in a particular order. It's essentially a set of single posts that go out all at the same time. To create a thread, tap on the post icon. Then type your text and add media to your initial post. Now this is the important part. Hit the enter key three times. This will allow you to create additional posts. The thread in our example here will have a total of three posts. However, you can certainly add more if you'd like. In the last post of our thread, we're going to add a GIF, which is the same as adding an image. Before doing this, you will have to have a GIF already saved on your phone. So we'll simply tap on the attachment icon, select the GIF from our phone, and then hit add. Once you're done creating all of the individual posts, hit post. This will publish your thread and your followers will be able to read your thread in its entirety. Deleting a post. If you change your mind after creating a post and realize you'd like to delete it, you can do so by tapping on the three dots in the top right hand corner on the post itself. Hit delete and then delete again to confirm. Liking, commenting, reposting, and quoting. To like someone else's post or thread, simply tap on the heart icon. To comment on a post, tap on the comment icon, then enter your text and hit post. While we only use text in this example, you can add media to your comments if you'd like. To repost a post or a thread, tap on the repost icon and hit repost. This will add the post to your profile. To quote a post, tap on the repost icon and select quote. Type in your text and hit post. Sharing a thread's post to Instagram. Keeping up with all of these social media platforms is going to be a lot of work. To make things easier on yourself, you can share a thread's post straight to your Instagram account. Tap on the share icon of the post you'd like to share. Now this can be your own post or someone else's post. You'll then have several different options. Add to story, add to feed, tweet, copy link and share via, which opens even more options to choose from. To add to your Instagram story, tap add to story. Instagram will pop open and you'll be able to add text, GIFs and other creative assets before posting to your story. You can also post to your Instagram feed as a regular post. In this case, we'll hit post to feed. Make edits like you normally would in Instagram, add a caption, tag others, and so on. Once you're ready, hit share in the top right hand corner. You'll now see your post on your Instagram profile. We hope that this video helps when it comes to learning how to use threads. Instagram's new app is very popular and will only grow from here. Share your threads username in the comments to connect with others and let us know if you have any other questions.